Nice. Looks like you haven't punched anybody out lately. You know, the day is still young. And you're starting to upset me. Oh, come on. I'm just... Do you anything? Bad. I, I hit the guy because he took off with my wife. Your okay. ex-wife. Yeah, well, whatever. I'm cool now. I'm uh, cool. Are you? Well, maybe I wasn't, but I am now. Okay, so enlighten me. What changed? I told Amanda everything. She knows the story. I told her how Kara took off and how I felt afterwards, and it's, it's fine. Everything's fine. In fact, since this Castillo guy has shown up, I feel like I've taken all my baggage and put it on a plane and sent it back to Africa. I need a judge's ruling on this one. You're telling me you told your current wife all about how your ex-wife broke your heart? She's great. Everything, she's great. She now feels like she's the one that sutured my heart back together. My, my marriage is perfect. Never been more solid. <sighs> You shouldn't be calling her. Well, I figured you wouldn't answer the phone if you couldn't talk. I'll call you later, okay? <sighs> I was wrong. Rough night's sleep. Too much partying? No, not too much partying. I had to get a hotel room because my place is being repainted and it's just the fumes just, are just annoying me. Uh, so, room service, mint on your pillow, that doesn't really sound no, so No, 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 no. I never slept well in hotel rooms. Just way too impersonal. Hmm. You should stay with me. What are you doing? Oh, oh. Uh, hello. Perfect mistletoe timing. Mm. What are you doing here? Well, I wanted to give you an early Christmas present this morning. Are we alone? Mm-hmm. Pam took Emma and AJ ice skating, and Colby's at the library prepping for exams. Oh, well, didn't you think of everything? Of course. I know we can't be seen together. And now, I'm going to do something for you. Go ahead, open it. You are such a great gift wrap. Yeah, you're gonna like what's inside. Oh, well, they'll go away. It's probably Marissa. Why would Marissa be here? I'm sorry, it's my fault. Yeah, she's a little bit early, but I don't want to put her off. Exactly, is Marissa early for? I'm trying to keep the peace so she'll drop the custody suit, yeah, remember? Yeah, you're trying to keep the peace, not get back together. Which also means I can't risk her seeing you. But... Come on. Uh, and we'll finish this when, I, when I'm done. We'll, do, we'll finish the unwrapping thing, too. Here, here. My here, dress, so, look, it's pretty. It's beautiful. Hello? Marissa! I'm sorry, I know I'm kind of early. No, no, don't be sorry. That way we have more time to plan for our family Christmas. Morning. Morning. How are you? I'm uh, good. How are you? What are you doing? I'm just, I'm just grabbing a workout. I'm just really glad you left the drama behind you, you know? I'm proud of you. We got yacht 
Club, definitely roasted chicken is the way to go, I'm telling you. Okay. And we're back. This could be a problem. All right, listen to me. All right, she's talking. I'll bet you they're just talking. She got a couple tickets to the gun show. It's a big deal. Isn't it that great? Stop it. Yeah, he is. You want a bagel? Hi, honey. Oh, hi. Oh, bye. Bye. Hey, you. Hi. Hi. Hmm. 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 This is probably my cue to leave. Oh, you don't have to go. Yes, he does. We're done. No. Nope. Oh, or not. Hmm. Okay. Well, don't you want to save this for later when we're alone tonight? I can't really help it. When I see you, I have to have you meet me in the linen closet. Oh, well, I thought all you had to have was your specialty blend of coffee. You Ooh, left without it this my morning. My hazelnut mocha almond double half half <laughs> low percent milk frappuccino. This is the one. <laughs> Love you. Oh. You know, you trump caffeine, though. I, yeah, I will. You know that. Thank you, honey. I know, but thank you. Okay, good. So what's up? Why are you, what's cooking? Oh, I just stumbled by. Are you allowed to work out at the hospital? Because once he saw me, I mean, I, I had to stop and, and chat. But um, mm -hmm. can you get in trouble for doing that? Well, uh, you know, the physical therapy room isn't being used. Why not brush up early on your beach body, right? <laughs> well, there you go. I have to go because I'm meeting a woman um, from the Miranda Center for breakfast. Fantastic. That's good. Are you sure you're OK with me working? there with Griffin? They're lucky to have you. Well, just know that I love you. Yeah? Okay. Mm -hmm. You've been saying that a lot lately, but... Well, oh, you got a problem with it? No, I just don't want you to feel like you have to say it just because all this stuff came up with my ex. I mean, you have nothing to worry about. Are you gonna get any work done, or is today a total slack-off day? Hold on, hold on. Did I hear you right? About what? About inviting me to stay with you. <laughs> Wait a minute. You didn't think... I don't know what to think. Well, I mean... I mean, I wouldn't have... I, I meant you could sleep on my sofa in the living room in, until your place is finished, that's all. Oh, uh, thank you. But I wouldn't want to put you out. I mean, I do stay up all night reading, so you probably wouldn't get any sleep. You know, it's probably... better. Monroe, over here, now. Yes, Chief. Just read your report on the Hayward shooting. What were you thinking? Letting Ryan leave the crime scene after the shooting? <laughs> the guy almost died. He just wanted to see his You child. cannot afford to get sentimental on a case, Monroe. I would have done the same thing, Chief. Did I ask for your opinion? No. You were too busy making him feel like an Natalia, idiot. Please. You really need to remember who you're talking to, young lady. This is not fair. Who rained on your parade? Didn't want it rain. How's this for rain? You're off patrol. You're off your caseload. You're both assigned to the Hatch Hill Road stakeout. Rainy enough? The old abandoned warehouse. Yeah, that's the one. You gotta be That place has been on surveillance for over a month. Whatever drug activity is there is over. We don't know that for sure, do we? Yeah. So go, both of you. Find out for sure. Your umbrella. My rain. Hey, I was just wondering how much a gym membership cost. All right, well, you, all right, yeah. I'll call you back. Thanks. No blood, no bruises. Excellent. I'm fine. I'm not that type of guy. Amanda can talk to whoever she wants to talk to. Yeah, try saying without clenching your jaw. Maybe okay, I don't everybody. like him in my hospital. No, I don't, that, okay? That's I said your it. problem. That's my... Is, uh, did you come here to support me? No, is this I'm, more support? I am because supporting. I'm, I'm saying, look, no, seriously, it's like, you got a great life. You do. You, you got it made. You got a terrific wife. You got an amazing kid. You don't need to sweat the fact you got an Adonis running around. It's a lot younger and a lot bigger than All right, you maybe were. I didn't deal with everything the way I should have. Up to now, I, I, maybe mean, I just should have done... I, maybe? Really? Maybe? You know what you I think? should do? I should treat it like a wound, an old wound. I should open it up, clean it all out, and then sew it back shut forever, and that's it. Okay, I'll bite. How do you intend to do this? Well, I don't know that part yet. Dr. Hubbard left these insurance forms for you. We'll need them by the end of the day. Don't worry. They only want every detail of your life. 
every dirty little secret. Oh, Annie. Hey, are you here with someone? No, I, I just, I, no. You know, I'm supposed to meet a woman from the Miranda Center. Oh, well, well then it won't bother you. No, no, she just canceled. So, come on, don't just stand there. Come over. Take a seat. Take your coat off. I can't. Oh, 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 I thought you just said you weren't with someone. Oh, no, 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 I can stay. I just, I can't take my coat off. I'm almost afraid to ask. Well, uh, it was supposed to be a gift for JR, but he never got a chance to unwrap it because she showed up. She? She, Marissa. <sighs> oh, oh, can you go back? I feel like I missed something. Are you and JR? We're together. For real this time. Almost. Almost. Well, we can't really go public because of the whole custody thing, and that's kind of why Marissa's at the mansion, which I get, but well, are I just... Are you sure this is what you want? Yes. This is exactly what I want. JR and I just got back from this amazing trip to D.C. D.C.? Well, isn't that where you guys first? Yeah. And it was crazy. Not only were we in the same city, but we, we ended up in the same hotel in the exact same room. It's like fate brought us together or something. So we've been um, a couple, you know, quietly a couple ever since. Well, except for today, because he's with Marissa. Yeah, I mean, but he's just talking to her. I mean, Amanda, I feel like it's, this is really it this time. Why do I feel like you've said that before? No, no, no. I am telling you, this is different. JR and I, we get each other. We're like the same person. It's like I'm not trying to live up to this impossible ideal. You know, I can, I can just be me. Listen, if you're happy, then I'm happy for you. But are you okay with the secrecy? Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's kind of sexy, you know? At least it's... It's fine for now. Well, uh, the custody battle with AJ could drag on, you know? Well, JR is trying to, you know, fix this problem without fighting Marissa. He's trying to kind of win her over with his charm. Right, and that definitely wouldn't work if she knew you were back in the Well, picture. exactly, which is why she can't know for a while. What? I just hope that this is enough for you. As long as I end up with JR, it is more than enough. All right. <clears throat> oh, uh, JR said that he would he'd call when he's finished with Marissa's. Should just be a couple of minutes. I told Alberta that chocolate croissants are still your favorite, right? Yeah, they are. Is something wrong? I agreed to come here to discuss how we could divide AJ's time between us on Christmas Day. A family holiday is a whole different thing altogether. I guess when I was going through the ornaments, I got a little nostalgic. I wanted to show you something. You remember this? Yeah. How could I forget? I helped AJ make it. You never made it onto the Christmas tree. But I took it everywhere when I was sick. I even took it to chemo and hung it on the IV pole. For good luck. It's hard to believe that something so fragile survived. <laughs> it's hard to believe that I survived. I only did because of you. 